Well, hello, this is Reverend Amy at St. Luke Simpson United Methodist Church, and I just wanted to bring to the forefront a scripture passage. After reflecting on Reverend Black's message this weekend, I found myself reading Colossians 3 um, over and over again. And I found myself focusing in on chapter 3 in Colossians, verses 12 through 17. And I'd like to share it with you just as a means of hope um, and encouragement and inspiration of how we as Christians should live through this time, even though it's so hard. Um, we should live in response to our faith rather than the fear. So hear what Colossians 3, verse 12 through 17 has to say to us today. Therefore, as God's chosen people, holy and dearly loved, clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. Bear with one another. Forgive one another. If any of you has a grievance against someone, forgive as the Lord forgave you. And over all these virtues... Put on love, which binds them together in perfect unity. Let the peace of Christ rule in your heart, since as members of one body you were called to peace. And be thankful. Be thankful. Let the message of Christ, the good news, dwell among you richly as you teach and admonish one another with all the wisdom through psalms, hymns, and songs from the Spirit singing to God with gratitude in your hearts. And whatever you do, whether it be in word or deed, friends, do it all in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through him. The word of God for the people of God. Thanks be to God. This has been our scripture of the day, Colossians chapter 3, verses 12 through 17. Blessings to you and your family.